was injured. Those firefighters had to clean up after the fire in some frigid weather. If you've been outside, you know all too well just how cold it is out there tonight. We don't see frigid temps like this all that often. And people who have to be outside are glad about that. News Channel 5's Chris Cannon caught up with some folks who had to fend off the frostbite tonight. Chris? Well, Roy, it doesn't take long for this cold weather to get the best of you. The budding temperatures out here are hard to take, no matter what reason you have to be out here. As day turns into night and the temperature starts to plunge. It's too cold. It's too cold to be waiting out here. Workers on their way home do anything they can to fend off the frigid weather. Layers, lots of layers. Keep this thing over my mouth, you know, just, just stay bundled up as much as I can. And I... A few minutes at the bus stop can seem like forever in the cold. Good evening, ma'am. You have a very cold night to be doing this. Oh, you're telling me. Valet Dallas Reddy will be out here for 10 hours straight, only catching heat when he parks a car. Non-stop cold. Doesn't get any better. It's just... It actually gets worse as the night goes on. The water's already frozen. That makes stopping for a drink just about impossible. The valets and all those downtown workers, they'll eventually get home and warm up. But for the folks who live out here on the streets, it's a much different story. Hey, folks, we're with the rescue mission. Are you all okay tonight? Or? When the mercury dips this low, the Nashville Rescue Mission sends out the cold patrol, and it can be a lifesaver. Get us out of formation. We don't freeze to death. Giving folks a warm place to sleep and a hot meal, keeping them from becoming a statistic. I don't know what the numbers are, but every year we have people that freeze to death in Nashville. A tough night to do anything outside as we ride that weather roller coaster down to the bottom. Nashville's great for pneumonia weather. You go from 50 to, to zero in a heartbeat around here. It's ridiculous. And that has everyone hoping the plunging temperatures will start to climb again real soon. It's Chris Cannon.